Welcome, people of YouTube, Guy Gash here again today, and here we're going to be talking about risks and why it's important to take them in life. So I always talk about things from my perspective, but as you're watching this video, I want you to try and reflect it back to you and see what, what, what it might uh, entail in your life and what decisions it might spare in your life. So basically taking risks. What is a risk? A risk is something where there's pros and cons and there's a bit of an unknown about it. So if you're in a job or you're in a country, you're living somewhere, you're living with people and you're finding it monotonous, you're finding it continuous, a cycle going in and out and things are happening, you've got to take risks and you've got to make choices in your life that change that circumstance. You can't change you can't change your outside reality, but you can change what you do with yourself and you can change your internal reality, which in turn changes what's going on outside here. So for me, job changes, working with different people, I don't know what was going to happen before I changed job to, to, the, to the people I've worked, worked with now. And, and, you know, you don't know what that's going to be. So what is, why do we need to take these risks? Why is it important? Life is one big game. It's like one big massive school. And we're all here to learn different things about ourselves, mainly about ourselves, but what life's about and the interesting points of life and discover things about about life as it grows, as, as a, as a, as a species we've evolved and we're all evolving in his own individual lives so i found like job changes and stuff like that i it's that unknown and you get this feeling inside you where you want something to change and then that change comes and you you've got to make that leap that choice and you've got to go for it you've got to go for it and grab it with both hands so the monotonous side of what, you, what you're either experiencing or what you've previously experienced, the monotonous side, the continuous side, the constant cycle of experiencing this, I'm not liking living with these people, they don't make me feel nice, or whatever it may be, that's just examples, whatever it may be. Once you take that leap, number one, energy, whew, excitement, suddenly you feel alive, you feel awake, you're wondering what the outcome could be, it's exciting, um, the unknown, what could possibly happen, what's the outcomes, and you, 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 it puts you from, from sitting back and being stuck in a rut and feeling like you've got nowhere to go in life, to all of a sudden you're there and the, re the choices have been made and there's opportunities and so many different possibilities. You're not stuck in that rut and you're not stuck in that closed off environment. So another reason why it's important to take risks in life is, as I've mentioned, the unknown. But once, once, once that decision's made and you're taking that risk, more possibilities come and more things keep on coming. It, con it carries on and you'll find that all of a sudden you'll get to a certain stage in your life, right? And you'll look back and you'll see where the decision was made. Like, this happened, I chose to move house, I chose to move job, I chose to move out and go live on my own. And then it carries on and loads of different decisions come and keep testing you and keep trying you and all of a sudden you'll get to where you are present and you're a completely different person from when you began and what I'm trying to get through to you is these choices and these changes that keep coming up in your life are all test to see if you can take responsibility for yourself and that's what life's about you've got to take responsibility for yourself not care what other people's opinions are don't take into consideration and take advice but ultimately you've got to make your own choice it's you in your situation and you've got to make that you can't decide and go off other people's decisions because you'll just end up in a place where you really don't want to be so take that responsibility and say right this is my choice and yes they don't inside but that's excitement and you've got to take it on take life on and gr and really go at it full throttle don't just be a um a victim to your circumstances don't just be sat there taking it as it comes and yeah you can take the laid-back life and yes but what I'm saying is if you're stuck in a rut and you're stuck in a place where you're feeling like you can't get out of it or you're feeling that you're not happy then you've got to go and do something about it and make these choices for yourself life is an experience for us all and as individual people you learn it as you go on and you learn it for yourself you might make one decision and it turn really, really bad and it turns out really like how you not wanted it to go. You're on less money or 
you're absolutely broke or you're leaving me even worse people now or whatever whatever that may be but it's the learning it's the learning side of it and like i say life is just a school and we're here to learn and the experience you can't put a price on experience and once you experience something you grow from it and you grow from mistakes or you grow from life choices i've made decisions in my life and for the initial part it's like whoa what have i done here this is really really bad or really really big and daunting and i'm quite nervous about it or anxious about it and then a couple of weeks later or a day later or anything i feel completely different and the circumstances have changed and it just seems to carry on working so all i'm saying to you is go make them big decisions if you've got big decisions in your life Decide what you want to do. Connect with your heart space. That's another thing. You can't think your life. You've got to live your life. So if you're thinking about it all the time and thinking about all these good ideas but not doing anything about them, then you're just wasting your energy. You're just wasting your time. Put energy into something that you really want to achieve and really want to do in life. Keep motivated. Keep being inspired. And keep moving towards your dreams and aspirations and your goals in life and where you want to end up. Where you want to end up is completely different to where I want to end up. So don't go off what other people say. Don't even go off what I tell you. All I'm saying to you is, if you've got things to make, like decisions to make, or you've got places you want to go, or you want to... You, you want to go and do different things take them risks and go for it and go with the confidence and bear in mind that everything will always turn out all right everything will always turn out all right and you've got to believe that in your system and believe that in yourself and in your being that you are being looked after the universe is taking care of us all and we've got to carry on moving in the way of love and harmony and peace and keep moving towards these keep moving towards these goals if you deal with the situation with balance stability and it knocks you off and you feel anxious and you feel annoyed you're gaining more strength and from that and out coming out of that situation you will be a lot stronger person than the, you never want to get to the end of, end of your life we're only average person i don't even know how much average person lives now but you don't want to get to near the ending years of your life and say i wish i'd have done that or i wish i'd have done this so never be that person never be that person where oh i had the opportunity to go do this but i never did it and i've done it already i once once in school um a bit of a story here once in school there was a peru trip where i think it was in the last year of school um the opportunity was to go to Peru and you had to travel, you had to make your own travel arrangements in a sense of you had to find your own way to a different destination and that's what I found daunting. £400, this was like a £1,000 school trip, £400 into the school trip and that's what my parents had paid for me and then I turned around and I just said, I can't do it. I can't do it. Have to have it. After having that meeting of saying you've got to find your own travel, I just thought I can't do this. I cannot do this, and we cancelled it. And we cancelled it. And that was it. The Peru trip were over. That was it. And I've got to this stage now. And I was 16 at school, and I'm 21 years old now. And that is one. I don't live with mistakes, and I don't embody that. But that's something I just wish I'd have done. And you know what? If I'd have gone and done that experience, can you imagine the experience that you'd have of experiencing that place and talking to friends who had been there? So just never get into that position in life. Never get to that stage of I wish I'd have done this. Don't embody regrets. Don't keep hold of regrets. Once you've made a decision, let it go. But what I'm saying to you is grab opportunity, expect po possibility. There's a massive energy change going on on the planet. And what you're trying to manifest is just around the corner. Health, wealth, stability, strength, balance, love. Everything's coming your way. Believe in that, want that, and it will come. I hope you've enjoyed this video. It's been a it's been a good one. I've been meaning to make this for a while because I'm trying to make more videos that are reflected into my life and right now I've got a lot going on. I've got a lot of choices and changes and possibilities coming and I'm just deciding to go with what my heart tells me and I'm trying to go in the right direction for myself and make my own choices. I've got a million and one people telling me loads of different things and loads of different advice but at the end of the day it's down to me and it's also down to you watching this. So make sure you're making the right decisions. I hope you're all well. I hope life's treating you good. Make sure at the end of the day you show a bit of appreciation for what you've got in your life and keep giving a woohoo every morning when you wake up. Love and peace to anybody watching this, man. Take it easy.